In this episode, we'll be talking about the ongoing development of a typed API for first-party middlewares and three new assertion methods that you might use to test Laravel applications. Laravel is middleware, provide a great way of inspecting and filtering HTTP requests before they enter in your application. However, when middlewares have arguments, you may get confused to understand what this 10 and 1 are referring to. And that's why, on the latest version of Laravel, we are starting to introduce a typed API for first-party middlewares. So here in this example, you can use a throttle request middleware with a max attempt of 10 and a DK in minutes of 1, so you know exactly what these arguments are referring to. This API is being incrementally shipped across all first-party middlewares, and you may expect news and documentation about this in the future. Laravel is test response class provides multiple assertions that you can use to test the response you get back from your HTTP layer. In this example, we are performing a GET request on the root endpoint, and then we are asserting that we have a 200 status code. To keep your application test more elegant, you can use assert OK instead of assert status 200. And as example, you can use assert not found instead of assert status 404. And on the latest version of Laravel, we are actually introducing three more methods. The first one is assert gone to replace assert status 410. You can also use assert internal server error to replace assert status 500. And finally, you can use assert service unavailable instead of assert status 503. Thank you so much for watching and see you all next week.